Hello, my lovely ducklings. How are you? This is Miss Cherie. I miss you so much, and I wish to you soon. Hope all of you are fine and safe. Today's our video will be for science. Are you ready for science? Okay. Before we start, and as we mentioned before, this week will be for revision. So you should print our revision sheet from the website to be able to follow our videos. Let's get started. In this video, we will take about or discuss together three topics. They are day sky, night sky, and water uses. And actually, these topics are there in our revision sheet, page one, two, and three. Here is we have the first page of our revision sheet. What can you see here? Mm, some stars, moon and sun, and some activities on the other side. So how can we solve this exercise? Before we are thinking about this, we just need to take a quick revision about this topic. Here we have a picture shows day and night. How can we differentiate between them? Okay, we said before that if we go and look over your window, you will find a different views in the sky in different time. For example, if you look over your window in the morning, you can find light sky. From where this light? Of course, it's from sun because sun gives us light. And what can we see also? We can see some fluffy white objects. It's called clouds. And some birds. But what about if we go at night and look over the window at the sky? We will find the sky is dark and there is some stars and moon. Look at this picture. What can you see here? Mm, there is a smiley sun and clouds and birds are flying. So, can you say to me, this picture shows daytime or nighttime? Super! Of course, it's daytime. And what about this picture? It's dark. And there is the moon and some stars. So it's day or time, daytime or night time. Sure, it's night time. This picture is summarized for all information. During the day, I can see clouds, sun, and the sky is blue. And at night, I see moon, stars, and the sky is black or dark. Let's back to our revision sheet. Here is page number one. And we know already that if we see moon and stars, so it's night time. And if we see sun, it's day time. And what about the other side? Let me check, let's check the first picture. It's some kids are playing together in the playground. When can you go and play in the playground with your friends? At daytime or nighttime? Good, at daytime. And what about the sleepy back here? We can sleep at night. Next picture. The rest of the kids are going to school. When can we go to school? At day time. And what about the last one? Here is a boy. He is sleeping. I sleep at night time. Next page, we have two verbal questions in the top. Let's go and try to solve it. 
What can you see in the sky at daytime? As we said, at daytime we see sun and clouds. Second one, what can you see in the sky at night time? At night time we see moon and stars. Page number three. Look at next picture and say three uses of water. Uses of water. Do you remember them? Before we solve that, we will take a quick revision about this topic. Uses of water. Let me ask you some question. Is water important for us? Of course. Water is very important for us. We can't live without water. Can you live without drinking water all over the day? Of course not. So, now we will talk about some uses of water. Number one, drinking. Repeat after me, drinking. All living things need drink water. Again, drinking. Next, what she is doing here? She is watering the plant. So, it's planting. So, the first thing, drinking, planting. What is she doing here? She is washing clothes. So, this is a use of water. Number one, repeat it with me with a loud voice. Drinking, planting, washing clothes. Number four, take a shower to get fresh. You should clean your body. So, we use water for drinking, planting, washing clothes, take a shower. And last one is washing hands. And of course, you know that nowadays you should wash your hands a lot and a lot. And do you remember our song about washing hands? We said, soap and water, soap and water, wash your hands with soap and water. So, you should wash your hands with soap and water. Last time, repeat it after me. The uses of water is drinking, planting, washing clothes, take a shower, washing hands. Back to our sheet. We have here the pictures of uses water, the need of water. So, can you name it? Of course, look at the picture. The first one is washing clothes. Number two, planting. Number three, take shower. Number four, drinking. And at the end, washing hands. At the end of our video, I, ha I, I hope you have enjoyed and Stay at home to be safe. See you next video. Bye bye, honey.